I'm Alan Smith. You know, when I'm not taping my three different television shows, writing books, doing a radio show, traveling around the country, doing lectures, and also bringing my crew along to do some taping, I'm working on this 650-acre farm. Not alone, I have plenty of help from my brother and sister-in-law. I always wanted to build them a house because they do so much. So here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna build a new house for my brother Chris and his wife Joyce. Okay, but here's the kicker. I have to build this thing with a budget of $150,000. And since I'm a conservationist, we also have to build it as green as I possibly can within 150 days. And if it wasn't for my brother and my sister-in-law, I really couldn't have this place. They really do run it. And so I just feel really excited and fortunate to be able to build this, this house and, and for it to be for them. You know, there's a lot of talk about carbon footprints these days. So we're working really hard to source the materials as close to this project as we possibly can using local craftsmen. That's all helping keep the price down and for us to stay on the green target. I've built houses before. In fact, my house downtown actually moved 18 blocks onto a lot. And man, what a nightmare. You know, it turned out to be a really great house. It's very traditional in style, modeled after a late 19th century colonial revival home. When I built this farmhouse out here on the hill, I decided that I wanted to make it more in the Greek revival style around 1840 and make it look as old as possible, but with all the new amenities and make it as green as I possibly could. And let me tell you, I learned a lot building this house. I want to take all of that information, put it together, and create this small farm cottage. And I want to do it for less than the average cost of a home in America today, which is $200,000. The interior, we're going to be doing some fun things in there uh, that are, aren't going to cost a lot of money because we've got a budget. And, uh, but they're going to be really clever, I think, and I, they're ideas that have been rolling around for a long time that I've wanted an opportunity to apply and really haven't had a place to do it. So this little cottage is the perfect place. They say an eco-friendly house can't be built in 150 days for $150,000, and I say it can. I'm Alan Smith. Join me as I push the limits with time, budget, and creativity with the Garden Home Challenge, exclusively on eHow Home, only on YouTube.